And Missouri Nation, show of hands, who has had a fear of stalls? Welcome to the Safer Pilot Challenge. What is happening? M Zero Way Online Ground School. Jason Shepard here up at altitude with you all. Who knows what day it is in the Safer Pilot Challenge? As I was getting ready to do this video, I said, you know what? I, I can't remember what day it is. We've done so many videos. Check it down below. Remind me what day this is of the 31 Day Safer Pilot Challenge. And then check it down below. I know what we're talking about today, though. We're talking about stalls. And I ask you a question. When you're checking in down below, who has had a fear of stalls? A fear of stalls. I, I was that way. I flew a, uh, a 19, I want to say a 67 Cherokee 140 Hershey bar wing. And when she was done flying, she was done flying. And you would stall. Well, I had a very wise instructor who back then it was PTS. Now we fly under the ACS. And she said, Jason, nowhere does it say in a power on stall, we have to go full power right off the bat. Eventually we need to work our way that way. But for now, build your way up to that. And that's what I want to show you here today. When you're doing a power on stall, you don't need to go full power off the bat as you're just learning. Eventually, I need you to get there, right? But for now, we can work our way up to it. So let's do this. Let's make it realistic though still. Nice trim down airplane. What are we simulating with a power on stall? With a power on stall, we're simulating we just took off. We just took off. Uh, ATC told us climb immediately, whatever it is. We're just not paying attention. We pitch back way too much. We stall the aircraft. That's what we're simulating here. So I want to make it as realistic as possible. So I need to slow the airplane down to rotation speed. A common student pilot error is people go from cruise flight like this and just yank the airplane back and go to stall. That's not realistic. A more realistic approach is to slow the airplane down, similar to like doing slow flight. If you use flaps for takeoff, you're going to put your flaps in there. If you have a retractable gear aircraft, you're going to put your gear down. Right? You want to make this as realistic as possible. So I'm going to bring some power back here, and I'm going to pitch for airspeed, power for altitude. Who knows what I mean when I say pitch for airspeed, power for altitude. If that saying doesn't make sense to you, that's okay. It didn't make sense to me for many, many years. And then one day it clicked. I pitch for airspeed, I power for altitude, and my flying uh, has never been the same since when that phrase finally clicked for me. Use some trim to help you out. No need to be the Hulk. Remember we talked about that on uh, day five, right, with the oil being the Hulk. We don't want to be the Hulk. I'm slowing down to a nice rotation speed here, about 65. Do my best to maintain my altitude here. Everything's good. Clearing turns done already, by the way, and everything's all set up with that. Here comes my, uh, just about my rotation speed. I'm going to simulate a takeoff, but I'm going to show you how to baby your way into a power on stall. We're going to go car beat in at 65, and I'm going to go 2,000 RPMs, all right? And it's not going to take much, 2,000 RPMs. And here's another mistake. People want to chase it, right? They want to keep pitching back, pitching back, pitching back. You're going to get an aggressive stall that way. Grab an attitude and hold it. Stall Warren horn, by the way. Not yet. Okay, take it up another few degrees. Hold it. Okay, not yet. A few more degrees. Hold it. Stay coordinated. All right, hold it. Hold it. Hold it. And here it comes. There it goes. Push it forward. I need to go full power for a real recovery there. And let the nose come back. If you trim this airplane up right, it's going to want to return. Not to a secondary stall, though, but it's going to want to return to level flight with that amount of power. Let's do it again now, and let's do it with full power this time as we just are babying our way up with our stalls. Slow myself down. So what I meant earlier, um, with so a lot of people want to just keep pitching back, pitching back, pitching back till they find that stall, and you get a really aggressive stall. And some aircraft just stall more aggressively than others. That, ju that just happens here. What I meant, though, is grab an attitude and hold it. Okay, that's not stalling. Give me a few more degrees. Hold it. Not stalling yet. Okay, a few more degrees. Stop trying to just rip this airplane up. All right, here comes my 65. Car feet's coming off. This time I'm going full power. Remember, we're still dealing with left turning tendencies even. So you're going to need a, a heavier right foot as this happens. Nose comes up. All right, this probably will do it here. Let's hold this pitch attitude. Nope, not quite. She's a sporty little engine. We're going to be logging rotorcraft time here pretty soon. Huh? I'm up at 20 degrees. Hold it, hold it, hold it, and there she goes. Push her forward, push her forward, push her forward. Your your throttle is already full. Your car beat is already in. That's your recovery. And look, the nose comes back up on its own. If anything, I have to stop it, get myself back to cruise flight, 
Make sure you're tripped up nice, and then look at your examiner and say, what maneuver would you like next, sir or ma'am? That simple, right? I know stalls are scary, but you've got to practice them. The goal of the 31 Day Safer Pilot Challenge is exactly that, to make you a safer, smarter pilot, to make 2023 your safest flying year yet. That is what we're really after um, in all of this and, and everything that we do here. So listen, if you love my teaching style, if you're loving these free videos we put out here on YouTube, imagine how good the paid videos are inside of the online ground school. Check it out, m0atrial.com. So our prices are going up at the end of the month um, as well with our rising costs and everything else. So lock in your prices now. If you need a writ test, if you need a check ride, uh, whatever you need, if you just want to be that safer, smarter pilot, hop in the online ground school. Now take a trial of it though. Make sure you like it first, m0atrial.com. Have a blessed, abundant, outstanding rest of your day. And most importantly, remember, Good pilot is always learning every day, everybody. I'll see you.